another video and getting back into my hauls doing the things that you guys seem to really like and so i'm back with another try on today and it's really nice to be back into the try-ons because i feel like i guess my wardrobe hasn't had as much new additions to it lately and i actually just cleaned out my well i cleaned out my whole closet when my sister was here but i got rid of tons of things and the thing that i realized was the most overrun was my athletic drawer i had like old yoga outfits that like were kind of like threadbare that i wore for too long or didn't have the proper support i've like changed sizes so i think i had a lot of things that like didn't fit comfortably anymore to work out so I'm working on revamping that drawer I love nothing more than when I pull it out and everything's organized nicely like by set nothing makes me happier so I absolutely love that and I know I talked like a while ago about doing a closet tour but I'm about to do a big closet clean out and a reorganization and so I feel like I kind of want to wait for that to share it all but anyway all that to say today we have a fabletics haul i'm getting back into working out after several months hiatus focusing on movement that makes me feel good so i've started doing like hot girl walks in the morning i started walking for 10 minutes after every meal just to kind of like let things settle a little better there's been a lot of like changes i feel like health wise that i've been working on implementing slowly habit stacking because it's so easy to get gung-ho about things and it's really hard to make them stick so so uh, without further ado, today's haul is sponsored by Fabletics. I've talked about this before, but if you are new here or you missed my previous uh, chats about Fabletics, I have been a paying member since 2017, I want to say, and I still am. I could literally pull up my like bank statement slash email slash fabletics and show you all the, like the credits um i still pay and even though i get things sent to me for free because i'm an ambassador i still love it so much i feel like i've gotten like my friends my family everyone really into it so I genuinely love and I will continue to be a paying member. I mean, I would love to continue to work with them and I hope that's the case, but uh, I genuinely am a huge fan. So I recently feel like I've switched from ordering larges to extra larges with them. But if you guys ever wanna talk about sizing or anything, let me know. Their size charts is pretty accurate. I think things run just a tiny bit generously and I like my um, like athleisure where it'd be like snatchy, sucky any. So like, I just like it to feel like firm and supportive. And so I feel like extra large fits me perfectly right now. And it's very normal for our sizes to fluctuate and our weight to fluctuate. And so if you are in a season where that's happening, yeah, just be gentle with yourself. And yeah, I just wanted to announce that this video is sponsored by Fabletics, but as always, all opinions are my own. I will explain how their credit system works, like how their VIP membership works. If anyone that wants to know, and I can share like the offers that are gonna be live this month, but the exciting part that I'm excited for is my unboxing every month when my fabletics comes i get very excited but since i just cleaned out my drawer and i have a lot of space and since i'm starting with new workout routine starting uh, on friday and i've been doing my walks i'm finding that i'm going through more laundry so i'm really excited to like do like a whole athletic drawer restock so let's do that together today starting with a try on i'm already excited because look at all the colors i'm really really excited to see i don't even remember like what it is that i got but i just saw these colors and i was so excited so let's try them on right here it is i love this color like i can't even say enough i feel like it's so my color i love the way it looks in my house i love the way it looks on my bod i feel like it makes my little baby tan pop like i am into it and i will totally be wearing this for little walks around the neighborhood i think my only note is that with their shorts like i feel like as an in-betweeny right so i'm between like straight and plus size like right on the cusp with every brand it feels like and so when they grade up from it being straight size to like like curve like there's this a gap i feel like when it comes to shorts i definitely need curve cuts but for some reason when it comes to pants sometimes i i prefer more of a straight size cut all that to say oh, i just dropped it on the ground all that to say i feel like i might feel comfortable in a 1x in shorts and so i feel like whenever it comes to shorts specifically because of my of my butt honestly because i have like a bit of a tummy and a butt like i feel like and i'm tall and i have long legs i feel like with shorts i always need a little bit more room here in the booty so i will wear this because i think it's so cute but this may be more of like hanging in the yard running around like i don't know if i'd wear this around town i'd walk around my neighborhood in these but they are a bit booty which is fine with me but i'd probably want to size up to a 1x just to give it that roomy like really nice cozy roomy feel these are the go-to hold on i like pulled the tag so i can actually tell you because i always forget the names and i know when you guys are looking for things it's really helpful to have the actual name and not a name that i make up in my head okay so this is the lightweight go-to slim sweatshirt oh i'm really excited about this bra let's talk about this bra so this is the no bounce sports bra mm, again i'm gonna look at the actual name 
So this is the no bounce high impact sports bra, or perhaps it's called the high impact no bounce sports bra. All those words are combined in the name, okay? But the important part is we're gonna do a bounce test right now because when I'm looking for sports bras, I generally feel like they're hideous. <laughs> Am I right? Like they're always ugly if you're looking for like high impact and if you're looking for like a lot of hold, if you've got like a bigger chest like I do, I'm like a 36 triple DE um, and depending on the brand, like in a low me, I'm like a 30, 36 G. So like we've got, we've got some boobs on us, all right? Like this is so cute. It has this little keyhole. It has like the little openings, which reads as less coverage, right? But it still has a cover. So to me, it still feels like fun and sexy, which is important to me. There is this psychology for me about working out. And when I get dressed up in a cute matching outfit, like that's half, that's half the battle. Like I just feel more put together. I feel better. I used to work out in like massively oversized sweatpants and t-shirts. And I just would feel gross because they were the clothes that I wore when I felt bad about myself and I was sitting at home and feeling gross. Like I do think there is a ceremony to getting dressed, no matter how, like what you're getting dressed for. And movement is a very important one, especially if you have any negative associations with movement or any hesitation or any limitations, like anyway. So all that to say, I feel like this is a huge win. Like this alone is like a pretty big deal. So let's do the bounce test. My floor might be really loud, so just be prepared. Oh my gosh, oh my God. It's literally not bouncing, look. Oh my gosh, this is a wing. This genuinely works. Genuinely good. I'm gonna show the sweatshirt on. I'm sorry, I'm really happy about this. This is a pretty big, a pretty big deal. Like now that I know the bar is here, like that I don't have to wear a hideous sports bra and layer it with this. It's like, oh, this is a big deal. And I'm sure it comes in other colors because they always have fun color. I think this colorway is called Sprout and it's new for them and I love it. So let's try it on with the sweatshirt and see like what this vibe would look like for my little hot girl walks. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I'm sorry, I love it. This is so cute. And I like the, the length, the sweatshirt's like kind of cropped. If you would want it oversized, you could obviously size up. This is an extra large, and I think it fits me perfectly. Oh, I feel cute. It makes me happy. I'm gonna wear this on my walk tonight. Oh yes, so let's take this off and let's take our shorts off. Ah, there's lighting too. I don't know if that, excuse me. <laughs> I don't know if that transition worked, but I tried so hard. Does that count for anything? These are, Jeez Louise, Juan LaCroix. One well, LaCroix, she can't stop with the gas. These are the on-the-go high-waisted leggings. They are a power hold material. So if you're familiar with athletics, just be aware, like it's very like com high compression. Sometimes it can feel like a lot getting into it, but once they're on, I feel like they sculpt the bod like no other. And I just think this outfit looks so cute. I love the pockets. It has this like mesh pocket. So for me, I'll, I put my phone in there and then I have my earbuds in or my earphones or whatever. So yeah, I think this is just, Aces. And you can put the little sweatshirt on with it. Like, let's just do it for fun, shall we? Oh, I'm actually super excited about this. Since I've reintroduced color to my wardrobe, I feel like things are a lot more fun. And I'm really enjoying my walking again. I walked a ton during the pandemic and I haven't been now. And then actually a girl I follow on Instagram inspired me to start again. And I downloaded a walking app. I've been getting into podcasts. It's a great time to catch up with friends and family. I just love looking around the neighborhood. Like I love seeing this little kitten that's growing up. And I love checking out how like my neighbor's plants are doing and like there's so I don't know it's just something neighborhoody about it you get to know the other people that are walking like I started walking in a whole new area the other day and I found the most beautiful houses like this is a walking era for me and I'm liking it it's a, it's a homemade ice cream era and a walking era and the time I mean they should go hand in hand do you know what I mean so it's great this is very cute let's see what the next thing is I'm literally unboxing it as we go so hot and sweaty <laughs> it's a hot day out there oh yes I don't have enough biker short outfits especially now that I told you it's a hot girl walking era. This is so freaking cute. So it has like a little Fabletics logo. I love a stretchy ribbed moment. So I'm very excited about this. And then, huh, okay. I was expecting it to have like a little, the little logo on it again, but it has the ribbing on the side. So it kind of goes together. This is cute. I don't know what the impact on this, this bad boy is. It's uh, called the Sink Seamless Bralette. So I feel like with this bralette, it would be more of a less a um, support moment but these would be great for working out, I can already tell. And I think that this would actually look super cute with this bra. So I like to mix and match, especially like when the colors are all fun and bright. Let's see how this looks. Okay, so this is the sink set. I won't make a boy band joke. So it's not like the kitchen sink, it's like in sink. I just, I said I wasn't gonna reference it, I did. It's fine, it's fine. This is the sink set, and this is the perforated high-waisted short. It's a six inch, because I know, I thought biker short was a biker short. I've been having them low and high and long and short. It's all whole thing. So this is the six inch. This is a, a seamless bralette. Super duper comfortable. This is obviously not gonna be high impact, so if you wanna see like, 
the bounce test like there will be bouncing happening here so it just depends on obviously your needs your chest size your activity level like what you're gonna be wearing it for this is perfect for another hot girl walk moment this is like perfect for me answering emails from home like taking a little walk after breakfast like something not as high impact this would be perfect for me uh for that and that's definitely what i plan to use it for so if you see me on my instagram stories wearing these things every day you saw it here first i'm wearing an extra large in both pieces it feels plenty roomy sometimes when you pull a pants you don't get that first feeling and you're like I don't want to commit to this. It's going to be too much. These pull on so comfortably and easy. So these run a little bit more generously than the power holds and the everyday ones that I just wore. So these are a lot more stretchy, a lot more comfortable. That being said, of course, then they're going to be a little bit less sculpting, but I love the way they look. I think this is so cute. I love the color. Yeah, this is a very cute little walking outfit. Oh, okay. You know what? The straps are adjustable. So I guess if I adjusted them tighter, like they would be great for like lifting. I could totally do a workout them as well, but just, I wouldn't run or do anything super high impact personally but you know we all have choices to make we all have choices to make yeah so this is this fit i will grab the next one oh it's also a fun color let's open it together you know i love unboxing a moment together oh my god these feel really soft these feel very very soft okay so this is the ultra high-waisted pure luxe seven eights and it's very buttery this feels so good i'm excited because it's this is such a different variety of fabrics everything i got here is like pretty diverse in like the fabric stuff like this is the pure luxe i had the power hold and this is the ribbed oh this feels so good this is gonna be very cute so let's go try these on all right, this is my favorite sports bra that they have ever made. Although I will say that other one is now a contender, but this is the Oasis Twist Front Sports Bra. And you've probably seen me wearing this. I have it in multiple colors. It's just so good. First of all, it passes the bounce test, as you can see, but it gives cleave. Like, like I was saying, like I feel like my whole life, I wasn't able to wear the clothes I wanted to wear because of like undergarment situations and boobs and whatever. Like, of course, now I know that I can do whatever I want. But back then I did feel like very limited. And sports bras were one of those things that like they had to cover here here to like give me coverage right and now i'm just like i can live my life i can feel free i can feel hot and i that does all that at the same time anyway you can tell i'm very passionate about this subject so this is the oasis twist front sports bra and i was thinking about like oh when i first wore it i was like this is great and then i've had other sports bras that are a little sexy from other brands that shall not be named and they didn't pass all the other tests so like the bounce test that's that's level one that's kindergarten all right we're talking we need like the like so it's like like the like like the cycling test where like okay i'm gonna like do push-ups on the bar and i'm not gonna get hit in the face with my left boob or like deadlifting we're gonna do our little deadlift test like i don't want to be like popping out in front of my trainer or making people uncomfortable or like losing one <laughs> you know what i mean so it's good for as you can see for all those things i absolutely love this sports bra it's great and i really like the pure luxe fabric this is a seven eight so i'm trying to show you the full length so this is um i'm really tall so this is like just above the ankle but these are uh super high waisted and i just think these look so insanely hot on the body and the fabric just feels so buttery and smooth and good so i absolutely love this as well and then this is a wild card i wasn't expecting this i totally forgot so they launched their anywhere collection which i had done previously a video about back in the day like last year a few months ago Time flies, time to construct. But they are launching more. And so I wasn't sure because they're sizing again. I'm kind of between. So I got a 1X in the shorts. They look a little big, but they're these vegan leather shorts. They're really, really cute in this green. And then they have a tank top so it's this really beautiful ribbed seamless and then it has this braided detail can you see it's really sexy so i think my dream in life is that i can wear this and not wear a bra with it and it'll look hot and sexy so they paired the shorts with the long sleeve one so i got a long sleeve one i think that the gold hardware is also just like such a pretty detail on these so this is their anywhere like w-e-a-r it's clever then i got extra large in the tops and then i got the one x's in the bottom no so i got a one x in the pants so i got some black uh vegan black high waisted leather leggings because duh and then the shorts so i'm just gonna try both of these outfits on i just have no idea what to expect for the fit and stuff so let's do it <laughs> it's super comfortable like it feels like you're wearing loungewear like it's so comfortable so if you're wanting to look sexy and put together but you also want to be really comfortable i'm recommending this this time around the first time around i wasn't sure i ended up wearing the vegan leather leggings in like the minty green color a couple times but they were the extra large and i felt like they were just too tight and i feel like yeah it might be right between sizes but this is way more comfortable and i think they look really good so yeah i love this top and i would highly highly recommend this top i'm 
I'm gonna go try on the long sleeve one and then I'm gonna explain. I think I have a list of like what their offers are this month in case you wanted to check those out and you wanted to get any of this stuff or anything appealed to you. Okay, I like the long sleeve one better. This is the uh, seamless braided long sleeve and the vegan leather short. And this one is in smoke green. I think they also have the shorts available in black. But yeah, I think this is true for me that the one X is just like a little too big and the extra large is just a little too small. Welcome to the world of being an in-betweeny, as I'm sure you know. Cause like, I think that could totally pull them off. But like the waist is just like, it doesn't stay high waisted, do you know what I mean? Like they're just, they're too big. Like they're just, they look a little shapeless and a little too big, which is such a bummer. But if you are like a true extra large, like a 12, 14, like a solid 14, I think the extra large would fit you perfectly. And if you are more of like a 16, 18, these would be a good fit. Um, I think I'm like close to a 16, but I think just like cuspy, you know? Cause like, I just, I love the concept of these, but they're just a little, there's a cat on my front porch. Hi baby. I like this cat. I know that I've had problems with her in the past, but we've come to an understanding. She's probably waiting for my Postmates to get here. Maybe this is her patrol. Oh my gosh, imagine I went out there and she was just like going to town on it. Let's not imagine that because I'm very hungry. Anyway, as we were, this is really freaking cute. I think this is so hot and I have a feeling the boy is really gonna love this top. So top is definite win for me. Love the idea of the shorts. I guess I just wish they were, I could totally get them in an extra large, but then I worry they'd be like a little too small. So I don't know. Oh, so cute though. This outfit is really good. So I thought I would show you anyway. Um, but what do we think of this haul? I would love to know what your favorites are. I love their new collection with the nine new colors, all the bright, bold colors that are fun for mixing and matching. But I've been wanting to explore this Wear Anywhere collection because it's just like comfortable, nice, sexy, cool basics. So if you are looking for something like that, like obviously like the pants like can go from like work to out, etc. Maybe this isn't work, I don't know. You do you and I don't shame anyone for their, their clothing choices. But um, I thought that I would do a quick little rundown of how Fabletics works because I have gone and some DMs with people that like don't quite get it. Okay, so it is a membership. Uh, they charge you a monthly fee. It's a it what it has been I think forty nine something. It's around it's like just under fifty dollars a month. But you can skip any time you want. You can cancel any time you want. But obviously, if you don't remember to skip, it will charge you. But that gets you a member credit, and a member credit gets you an outfit. So if you buy it without the credit, it's much more pricey like so you can essentially get a whole outfit for the 49 ish dollars whereas if you were to buy it alone like the leggings are like 80 the tops are like range a different price range between like sports bras and tops you essentially get an outfit every month for that amount so a full outfit for that amount but then you also get you don't have to use the credits every month so they they like accumulate i guess and you can also use them at the retail location so they have i, I didn't know how many stores they have but apparently they have like over 74 like 75 stores nationwide i had so much fun when i went to the store there isn't one right near me so i haven't gone for a while but when i went to visit my sister in florida my sister and my stepmom and i all went and we had so much fun like we tried things on the fitting rooms are so futuristic like you just like scroll and then the sizes just show up at your door and so i had so much fun shopping and then i like bought my sister an outfit and then i got her hooked no, she's a member yeah i think the stores are really fun so if you haven't tried their stuff and you're not sure about your sizing I would recommend going to the store if you have an accessible to you just because it makes it easier. And once you know your size, then you don't have to worry about it as much because the different fabrics kind of run differently. Like things, you know, like different uh, styles and shapes run a little differently and size wise. So their size chart is like kind of accurate, but I would recommend going to the store because I feel like I, I'm not gonna talk about the size anymore. I, I've made my point. So if you decide to sign up for VIP, I personally would like stock up when you do that because you, your first time you sign up, you get like, it's wild. I think you get like, yeah, 80%. Hold on, I'm gonna verify. I, it sounded too crazy to say out loud. So they have, uh, you get two bottoms for $24, which is amazing. So any two like leggings or whatever, but 80% off everything else. So you can really stock up. So obviously I'm restocking my little fitness drawer and I probably will end up doing like a closet organization video and like a major purge thing, uh, like a closet a closet clean out. But if you're looking to restock your fitness drawer and you need like a lot of things or if you've changed sizes recently or you just, you know, need a fresh start or need some refreshers. Cause I know like for me, my athletic clothes get kind of gross because I wear them a lot and they are worn a lot harder than my other clothes. Let's be honest. I wear, I wear lounge clothes like mostly all the time. So you get 80% off your first time you sign up for VIP, like essentially your first order. And then from then on, it's, it's what I said. So if you have any other questions, I know it can be confusing and yeah, I know you guys have had like, some of you have, have been confused about that or had issues with that. So that's how it works. Like I said, I've been like a card carrying member for years. So I do understand. And what else is I going to tell you? Uh, I don't know. I just absolutely love it. They also have men's now. So I bought Sparky a few things and he loves, oh my gosh, he's obsessed 
obsessed with the shorts that he got. He loves them so much. I'm gonna get him another pair. And yeah, we're just a, we're just a, a Fabletics family over here. So yeah, that's it. I don't get any like it's not incentivized for me if you buy like I don't have a, a code or anything. But it if you do decide to look or browse or sign up, it is helpful for me if you use my personalized link because when they're looking to like see like oh like who who should we keep working with etc. And I love working with them. It's really helpful if I can show like hey I've driven this much traffic or like my audience is interested in this. So if it doesn't pertain to you, obviously no. But if you end up looking, um, I did put my own like personalized link they gave me. It's just fabletters.com slash Alex Michael May below. And that helps them track to know if this resonates with you guys or not. If it doesn't, you know, feel free to skip. And I totally understand we all have our own needs and whatever. But if it does feel aligned with you and you are interested, check it out. Stock up if you need to. I hope that this empowers you to find fitness and movement. I don't like the word fitness necessarily. Find pieces of clothing for like movement and exercise and whatever it is that you do that feels comfortable and just challenge you to like do a little closet clean out, do a little like athletic wear clean out if you need to. And just know that no matter your body size or shape or whatever, like you are worthy of having clothes that you feel sexy and they feel good in. And then encourage you to want to go out and be seen and do things. I feel like that's what fashion has been for me. It's been a tool for me to live the life that I want to live. And it's been a really beautiful journey. So more on that later, because I I talk about it every video but I thought that I would give you guys that little spiel I hope this video was helpful I'd love to know your thoughts on stuff I will be wearing and styling these things and sharing them on my other channels so I'm just Alex Michael May across the board Pinterest Instagram TikTok where I do more short form fashion videos and if you are new to my channel and you found this video helpful or you felt like you want to be a part of this community it would mean the world to me if you would subscribe and we'd love to have you and if you're new introduce yourself say hello below or feel free to DM me I love chatting with you guys on there um, I'm happy Happy to be back doing my hauls and if you're returning bff thank you so much for being here as always i so so value that you have limited amount of time and the fact that you choose to spend it with me means so much so thanks for being here and uh yeah i will put the link below uh yeah this video was sponsored obviously all opinions are my own i don't know what else i need to say but i'm gonna go and i'll catch you guys in the next video